What's it like for an American who's now gone through their two vaccine jabs, they've done everything they're supposed to do, they've been under lockdowns, they've had the mask on, they've been socially distancing, they've been not living life the way we'd like to for a year now. How does it change once they've gotten their second jab? You know, it'll change gradually because you want to accumulate data to make sure. There are two elements here. You, yourself, and the danger to you if you're vaccinated versus what is outside in the dynamics of the outbreak outside of your own individual situation. Because if you're vaccinated and you're like five to 10% of the country is vaccinated, 15%, and there's still an average of 68,000 infections a day, what you can do outside, what society will allow you to do Just because you're vaccinated, restaurants are not going to open. Ball games are not going to be played necessarily. Theaters are not going to be open. So what you're going to be able to do is really going to be reflective of what your own degree of safety, what you yourself can do. So what we're going to be trying to do very soon, I hope, is to come out with some specific statements about if you are in this category, this is what you likely can do. But right now, the way things are right now, given the degree of infection and the dynamics of the virus in the community, that's the reason why we say you still have to wear a mask, even though you're vaccinated, because you could get infected, not know it, and be completely without symptoms because the the vaccine is preventing you from getting symptoms. But you could have virus in your nasopharynx and then inadvertently and innocently pass it on to someone else who's not vaccinated. That's the problem we're facing. Those um, rules for individuals who've been vaccinated um, are some, some basic guidelines for all of them that will be clear around behavior. A matter of days, weeks, do you have a sense of when that's gonna make be public? I don't wanna give a date on it, then someone will call back and say you gave the wrong date. <laughs> I think, I hope it's soon. I hope it's within the matter of several weeks to a month or more, so that <laughs> when you start to get really a larger proportion of the population vaccinated, people are gonna say more and more, hey, wait a minute, what can I do and what can I do now that I'm vaccinated? It's a very reasonable question.